today we are going to learn comparison of adjective subject english grammar for standard 4th what is an adjectives adjectives modify or give more information about a noun or a pronoun the words like long short tall big small etc that describes something about all adjectives adjective tells us about the quality quantity number or order of the noun that it that it describes today we are going to discuss about degrees of comparison of adjective in this lesson you will able to learn and understand the degrees of comparison of adjective and at the same time you will able to use them correctly are you ready let's look at the picture then read the sentences strawberry apple watermelon strawberry is big the apple is bigger than strawberry watermelon is biggest of the fruit what do you call the highlight word in this sentence the highlighted word big bigger and biggest are adjective they describe fruit strawberry apple watermelon adjectives can be used to compare things there are three types of adjectives this are positive degree comparative degree superlative degree today we are going to learn this three degrees of comparison positive degree positive degree shows no comparison for example reema is pretty pretty describes reema that she is very pretty so the description of reema is pretty second the strawberry is big the description of strawberry is big the strawberry the big describes the strawberry another one her dress is long adjective long describe the dress that her dress is long so this is a positive degree we call it has positive degree comparative degree comparative degree is used to compare two nouns or pronoun we add er to the adjective to show the comparison the word then is placed after the adjective for example strawberry apple you can see the picture strawberry and apple the apple is bigger than the strawberry adjective bigger compares the apple and the strawberry the word then is placed after the adjective so this is known as comparative degree that we compare two nouns or pronoun 
together. So, we call it as comparative degree. Comparative degree. Comparative degree is used to compare two nouns or pronouns. If adjective has three or more syllables, what is the meaning of syllables? Syllables means sound of vowels. The number of times you hear a vowel sound in a word is the number of syllables in the sentence. The vowels are A, E, I, O, U. So these are the syllables. When we find number of syllables, we put more before the adjective. The book is more expensive than the notebook. The adjective more expensive compares the book and the notebook. We put the word more before the adjective since the word expensive has three syllables. As I told you, syllables means vowels. So, we find three syllables that is E, E, E in the word. So, we have to use more. Superlative degree. Superlative degree is used to compare more than two nouns or a pronoun. We add EST to the adjective to show comparison. The word the is placed before the superlative adjective. For example, strawberry, the apple, the fruit. This watermelon is the biggest of the fruit. The adjective biggest compares the watermelon to the other fruit. And we add EST to the adjective. And the word the is placed before the adjective. Superlative degree. Superlative degree is used to compare more than two nouns or a pronouns. If an adjective has three or more syllables, what is the meaning of syllables? Syllables means sound of vowels. The number of time you hear a vowel sound in the word, the number of time syllables in the sentence. There are number of time syllables in the sentence. We put most before adjective. For example, the book is the most expensive of them all. The adjective most expensive compared the book to the another supplies. We put word most before the adjective since the word expensive has three syllables. Syllabus means vowels. So there are three vowels in expensive. E, E and E. So these are the three vowels. So we used most for the sentence which is written. The book is most expensive of them all. Let's learn more about the comparison of adjective. When adjective ends in Y, change the Y to I and add ER or EST. For example, tiny, tinier, tiniest. Tiny is in positive degree. Tinier is in comparative degree. Tiniest 
is in superlative degree. In other example, pretty, prettier, prettiest. When adjective ends in E, drop E and add ER or EST. In the picture, as you can see, nice, nicer, nicest. Now, nice is in positive degree. Nicer is in comparative degree. Nicest is in superlative degree. As we see another example, wise, wiser, wisest. Wise is in positive degree, wiser is in comparative degree, and wisest is in superlative degree. When the adjective ends in a consonant that follows a vowel, double the last consonant and add. E R or E S T. For example, cat is big, deer is bigger, La elephant is biggest. So big is positive degree, bigger is comparative degree, and biggest is superlative degree. The adjective big ends with a consonant and followed by a vowel I. So, we know that consonant which ends with G, we add ER for comparative degree and EST for superlative degree. Other example, fat, fatter. Fat is. Fat is positive degree. Fatter is comparative degree. Fat is, is superlative degree. Let us form the comparative and superlative degrees of irregular adjectives by changing the spelling. The first column is positive degree. Second, comparative degree and the third superlative degree as this are the comparison of degrees which are divided into three part good better best bad hill worse worst many or much more most far far Father, farthest. Adjectives. Adjective in first column are positive degree. In second column, comparative degree. And the third column, superlative degree. Once again, I will tell you comparative degree ER in adjective. More before the adjective. If the adjective has three or more syllables. And in superlative degree, we add EST to the adjectives. And we add most before the adjective. If the adjective has three or more syllables. For example, small, smaller, smallest, large, larger, largest, thoughtful, more thoughtful, most thoughtful, intelligent, more intelligent, most intelligent, good, better, best. This are the example of comparative of adjectives. We will look in another example. Example, tall. Rima is tall. Sima is taller. 
Mina is tallest. Rima is tall. Sima is taller than Rima. Mina is the tallest of three girls. See the picture and observe the picture. The adjective over here is big. Car, van, bus. The car is big. The van is bigger than car. The bus is the biggest among the three. Big is positive degree. Bigger is comparative degree. And biggest is superlative degree. Complete the chart by supplying the missing adjectives. The first column is superlative. Second, comparative. Third, Superlative. These are the three degrees of comparison. You have to fill the empty box of these degrees of comparison. Now let's see the degrees of comparison. Positive degree, comparative degree and superlative degree. First, close, closer, closest. Second, diligent, more diligent, most diligent. Cold, colder, coldest. Colorful, more colorful, most colorful. Many, more, most. Bright, brighter, brightest. Thank you. I hope you have understood Comparison of Adjectives